Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am so, so happy that you're here today and I hope that you are having a wonderful day as well. Um, as you can see by the title, today we're gonna be reviewing something just a little bit different than my other videos. Today will be, we, today we, you and I, will be reviewing the January Keto Crate box. Now, if you have not heard of Keto Crate before, it is a monthly subscription service um, that specifically ships out ketogenic or keto-friendly food items to allow you to try them out and get a feel for them without having to commit to buying full-size packages of um, these items separately, which definitely adds up because keto items are expensive. Um, I've been on the keto diet for almost 10 weeks now. I'm down 20 pounds. I've got a long way to go. Um, so anything that kind of motivates me and keeps me focused on staying keto, I definitely appreciate. Now the keto box is around $39.99 a month, but when I tell you it is jam-packed full of items, um, it definitely is. I did December's box. Um, I reviewed it, but I we'll post it soon um so you might see the december box and january box very close to each other but anyway i'm rambling let's go ahead and get inside the box and see what's going on all right so this is what the whoop, nope this is what the inside of the box looks like it's packaged very very well even though i can't hold it um it's so full the things are like popping out um and it is heavy this month so i'm excited to see what is in here um one thing that i really really like that they do is they include this little um pamphlet here mine's a little bent um but if you open it up it's like jam-packed full of information and really really cute graphics who's ever on the graphics team you're doing a great job um so it tells you about the um Crate Club, which is an exclusive shop for Keto Crate subscribers where you can then go online and uh, purchase the products directly from their website. Um, it comes with a secret password that's hidden in the back of the pamphlet. They always include a recipe. This one is for brownie chaffles. Um, there's a little a resource guide that has uh, documentaries, books, and podcasts about uh, the keto diet. It's just very motivational and gives tips and tricks on how you can stay focused on the keto diet and they always include a success story. This is Myra's success story. Um, I follow her on Instagram at low carb love or low dot carb dot love. Um, and she's awesome. She is an inspiration. So I'm glad that they featured her in here. And then there's a little quiz and they always include a little motivational card here. And it says, I want to see what happens if I don't give up and you're supposed to cut it out and put it on your fridge for fridge inspiration. So that's really cute. They put a lot of thought into these and I like that they included. So let's go ahead and get inside the box here. Let's grab the big one first. Holy moly, look at this. So this is the Catalina Crunch Maple Waffle Keto Friendly Cereal. Um, zero grams of sugar, 10 grams of protein, six grams of fiber, gluten and grain free. Um, here are the macros for uh, this item. This is a big bag. How many servings are in here? 10 servings. Packing shouldn't come with a sugar rush and health food shouldn't taste like cardboard. Preach. All right, so this is nine ounces worth of cereal. This is a lot of cereal and I have not had cereal since I started the diet. So I'm kind of excited to try that. Let's see, I also have the prices pulled up as I'm going through each thing. So this goes for $12, wow, um, $12.25 for this cereal. Um, but if you purchase it through Keto Crate, they have discount codes for items as well. So um, you can get 10% off that item. All right, so of course you can't have cereal without milk unless you're a psychopath just kidding um oh my gosh <laughs> okay so this is the um vanilla unplugged milk academia unsweetened vanilla macadamia milk this is also massive and i'm guessing it doesn't need to be refrigerated because it wasn't this is 32 fluid ounces uh fresh raw never roasted macadamia nut milk um dairy-free, lactose-free, and non-GMO. Wow, 50% more calcium than milk compared to, sorry, my face is itchy, compared to 1% dairy milk. Oh, this is from Illinois. Ooh, ooh. Illinois is where I'm originally from. I'm in Florida now. 
All right, and you are supposed to refrigerate after opening and use within seven to 10 business days after opening. There are four servings in this one, and these are the, oh, I'm gonna blind you. Blinded by the light. Let me just see if I turn it down. Okay, so yeah, those are the macros for the macadamia milk. All right, we're gonna turn that back up now. Wow, okay, so cereal and milk. And this goes for $6.04, so that's not bad. So the next thing in here is from Hecka Good Foods. It is the Keto Bar, peanut butter chocolate chunk, one gram net carbs, a grain gluten-free, 11 grams of protein, and no chicory root. Whoops, looks like this. Macros are out of focus. All right, that's not focusing, so I'm just gonna read it. Uh, let's see. Total fat, 14 grams. Sodium, 150 milligrams, no cholesterol. Uh, 23 grams of carbs, however, six of dietary fiber, and one gram total sugar, and three grams sugar alcohol, and protein is 11 grams. We'll see. I'm not the biggest fan of peanut butter. Peanut butter, I don't like peanut butter, and I'm not a big fan of nuts in general, um, which is really hard on the keto diet because that's what everyone eats, but um, I'll try it out. And these go for $3.25. Wow, there are a lot of big items in here. Um, so this is the pure, organic, sugar-free, bakeable chocolate fudge brownie mix. Gluten-free, high in fiber, and keto-friendly. This is 10.5 ounces. This is a big bag. Um, it says that it makes about 11 servings per container so about 11 brownies um besides this you just need an egg three tablespoons of oil and water who's messaging me okay um and then mix it and heat it which is great because i don't cook so anything that's quick and easy to make i'm for it's only five net carbs per brownie that's not bad brownies who who can say no to brownies um this also goes for six dollars and 99 cents all right so the next thing in here is another bar from raw rev glow radiance from the inside out and is a creamy peanut butter and sea salt bar with the raw superfoods 15 grams of protein um 14 grams of fiber two grams of sugar gluten-free non-gmo um this is three net carbs um once again not the biggest fan of peanut butter but i do want to try it just to see um and this one goes for $2.25. Up next, oh, this is cute. Um, this is from Iota, um, and it is the Roasted Sunflower Kernels. Um, it's umami flavored, so tamari and apple cider vinegar. I probably butchered that. Um, but yeah, there's quite a few in here. This is filled to the brim. Um, two ounces, uh, six grams of protein per serving. Uh, let's see two servings in here and let's see i just want to know umami a savory taste equals deliciousness we've used rich tamari and balanced it with a tang of apple cider vinegar modern and yummy this is not your mama's salt and vinegar okay i'm intrigued i gotta try this one now it's three net carbs per serving for this one and it's three dollars and 89 cents i also like that it's a resealable bag just because i can seal it back up once I'm done, okay. Mommy flavoring. Oh. oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna get. <laughs> oh, okay. I guess I should just open it all the way. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna need some more of these. That's delicious. Oh. It might be hard to stop with just one serving of these. Okay, I gotta put these down. These are really good. I know that I just said I don't like peanut butter and I don't like nuts, but sunflower seeds are a different story. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It's real good. Okay. Mm, we got a stick. Um, this is the. <laughs> Big Fork Craft Port Stick in original flavor. Seven grams of protein, 50 calories, and it looks like it's just a pork stick. I have never heard of this brand, but I kind of want to try this now too. 
Um, anyway, it goes for $2.50. And of course, zero net cards because it's neat. I'm just gonna get a little nibble. I mean, you can't go wrong with the with a pork stick. Um, yeah, I'm gonna eat this as soon as I'm done filming. That's gonna be my little snacky snack. So the next thing in here is from Just the Cheese. Um, their crunchy toasted cheese. Um, only two ingredients: cheese and jalapenos. Um, so it's a little dried cheese bar. It's 0.8 ounces. There's sounds like there's two in here. Let's just see what it says. Made in Wisconsin. It's similar to like the, the whisks. If you've had those, just instead of a circle, it's a rectangle. And yes, there are two bars in here. Man, I kind of want to try this one too. Okay. I'm so bad. Okay, just one, one more little nibble. I'm just hungry. You shouldn't open these when you're hungry. I can't get it open at all. Please open. I'm hungry. All right, it broke off a little bit. So this is kind of what it looks like. It looks like a Rice Krispie treat. <coughs> Ooh, that's got some kick to it. Yep, it's just cheese and jalapenos. That jalapeno is <clears throat> powerful, but that's tasty. But I'm not gonna take another bite of that right now. Goodness gracious. Um, so those go for a dollar ninety-nine cents each, and of course they are also zero carb. Oh, well, okay, I won't say zero carb, but like less than one carb. Practically zero carb. So the next thing in here is a Dang bar. Um, I've had Dang's coconut chips before. Um, this one is in, of course, peanut butter. This one does have chicory root fiber. I wonder what the issues are with chicory root since that other bar specifically made a statement saying it didn't have chicory. Anyway, this is in peanut butter, three grams of sugar, five grams net carbs, and nine grams of protein. Probably gonna pass this one along because um, I'm just like not into peanut butter like that, but it is a very soft feeling bar. So that's good. I don't know, I might try it. I don't, I don't know. Um, and that goes for uh, $3.33 each. And then finally, the last thing that we have in here is from, what is this brand? Oh, okay, K, K Nutri. It's an energy bar plus collagen and double chocolate cookie dough. Two grams of sugar, 15 grams protein, um, three grams net carbs, and this is 260 calories. Okay. Um, and these go for $3.50 each. I'm excited to try that one. I love chocolate and cookie dough. All right, so if you were to take the value of everything that we added today, now granted, I spent 40 or $39.99 for the box, um, the retail value of everything in this box is forty-four dollars and thirty-five cents. Um, hold on, where are my coupons? So typically, in these boxes, they include coupons as well as the pamphlet, and it's supposed to be like twenty dollars worth of coupons in the pamphlet. Hmm, I got chipped on my coupons. The total value of this box came to forty-four dollars and thirty-five cents. So yes, um, it's not like my makeup subscriptions where you're getting a huge value difference versus what you paid however you are paying for the convenience of not having to go out and find these items in the store yourself it's also exposing you to new brands that you may not have heard of and also giving you resources to purchase them online versus trying to do all this by yourself because it is hard sometimes so that was my january keto crate box let me know what you think down below um are you subscribed to credo credo are you subscribed to Keto Crate as well? Do you have any questions about the keto diet? Are you on the diet and you just wanna talk about it with me? I 
want to talk to you all. So thank you so much for watching my video. Please like and subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you like to. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.